Unit One: Our Surroundings. Chapter One: My Family. Time to think. Think and answer. Your paternal grandparents' names. Your maternal grandparents' names. Parents and children together make a family. The family serves to locate children socially and plays a major role in their education. Rahul and Sneha live with their parents. Their father is an engineer and mother is a doctor. They live in a small family. In a small family, parents can easily fulfill the needs of one or two children. They also can provide them best education and look after them very well. Their parents care about them very much because their family is small. Both mother and father earn money and satisfy their children's needs effectively. It means a small family is a happy family. Karun lives in a big family with his parents, one brother and a sister. His father is a teacher and mother is a homemaker. In a big family, there are parents with more than two children. His parents can't care about him and his siblings properly because of a big family. It means a big family is not a happy family. Even his parents are unaware of their children's needs. On the other hand, Pinky and Rohit live in a very big family. Their uncle, aunt, cousins and grandparents also live with them in their family. Their family is a joint family. In a joint family, grandparents, parents, aunts, uncles and cousins live together. In their family, all members help each other. Pinky and Rohit play with their cousins. Their uncle and aunt help them in their studies along with their cousins. And their parents also help their cousins in their education and socialization. Their grandparents tell them the stories in the night before sleeping. They love their grandchildren very much. To make our parents happy, we should help them in their works. Our mother makes food, washes our clothes, etc. Our father earns money for us and satisfies all our demands. We should keep our room neat and tidy. We should keep the clothes in the cupboards after washing and ironing. We should respect our parents and elders. We should obey their instructions. 